Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to DXB today, or welcome back, I should say. We have our wonderful co-host today, Ali, who wears many hats. Not only are you a mental health advocate, but you're also a performer, which we touched about. How do those two worlds come together? Um, well, I, as I just said earlier, I went to singing lessons and then I made a conscious decision last year that I wanted to be an artist. And that was after I looked deep in myself and I, because even though I, you know, you guys have keep telling me I've done a lot, but <laughs> this was my biggest dream and this is actually my biggest dream to share themes of mental health through music to be able to help younger people feel like they can relate as well. And you do that through your single Don't, which is yeah. released and you guys can watch online, look it up. Tell us about that. So Don't was actually written about an experience where I was just talking to a friend of mine and then she was talking to me about, and again, we, we spoke about it earlier on, how she couldn't talk about how she felt. Mm -hmm. um, and so I just came up with the line, don't let them know you're hurting. And I built the whole song around that hook. And then, yeah, it just came out. It was just uh, something that happened. And I felt it and it was an R&B sort of English, Arabic, Spanish vibe. I speak Spanish as well. Oh, well um, I love Spanish as well. I mean, this Spanish. guy, 27 years old and showing us up. Seriously, Ali. <laughs> <laughs> you make me blush. Slow, slow down, slow down. So what's the ultimate goal right now? What are you hoping to accomplish with your career? The ultimate goal is to be the, the, the best singer I can be and to be the biggest social impact uh, person that I can be out of the Arab world using the power of music to impact culture. This and is just, my goal. Just quickly, what are you performing for us today? Because we're I'm excited to I'm, per I'm performing a song called Runaway, yeah. and I wrote this song uh, with my friend and producer Belel Nasra in, in Cairo. Um, and basically, this song is about, again, it relates back to adolescent mental health. It's about a young uh, Arab who wants to be with their lover, but they can't because of their or her parents' circumstance. And that is the struggle, and the song is a just very catchy song. So. Well, we're excited to hear it. Thank you so much, Thank Ali, so and good much. luck with your performance. Now, we've been in a very zen mood today, and sticking with the theme, um, Amy recently hit up a holistic wellness center, so let's find out what that was all about. Today we're embarking on a journey of serenity and relaxation right here in the heart of our bustling city. I'm here at Samadhi Wellness, a holistic wellness centre that is said to be an oasis of tranquility right here in our fast-paced metropolis. I'm so excited to explore this facility and I can't wait to take you with me. So I am now joined by the founder of Samadhi Wellness, Samat. Thank you so much for inviting us to come and join you. Thank you, Amy. So honored to have DXB today uh, hosting uh, the first uh, interview here at Samadhi. Yes, yeah, so your first interview, because you've only been open for four months, I believe, right? Yes. Okay, yes. so this is, but you've had such an impact on the wellness community. Can you tell us why you think that is? What makes Samadhi different from other wellness retreats that are here in Dubai? So um, I think what makes Samadhi mainly unique is that it's a secret space where we all uh, join together uh, and everybody feels so special, welcome and cherished. Um, it's a community, a family. We all grow together and flow together here. I mean, definitely when I walked in here, I couldn't believe like what a hub it was like there was a real like kind of sense of a community people connecting over a coffee chatting about classes that they've just done or that are going to do there's a real sense of community in the space and I think that is the most important uh, one of the uh, very important values here at Samadhi is to make people feel connected so Dubai is known for its fast-paced lifestyle so how can Samadhi Wellness help people to disconnect from all of that so as you said, uh, today uh, Dubai is ranked as the fastest cities in the world and we always have deadlines and to-do lists and it's very important just to take an hour of your time or day, steal that hour, come to Sumadi, practice, meditate, connect with yourself. So can you tell me a little bit more about the facilities that you have here? So we touched on that you have your treatments and you have the classes. What else can you offer to people that are wanting to come to Samadhi Wellness? So we do all to have the wellness part, which is uh, the sauna mm -hmm. and ice bath. Yeah, uh, the swimming pool and um, a treatments, natural treatments for the body and for the hair. 
Amazing. Using all natural elements. Incredible. Well, I believe that I'm going to be trying out a foot treatment later. Amazing. Which I'm very excited about. Amazing. But first of all, I'm going to go and explore all the different spaces that you have. So it's sure. been a pleasure talking to you, Sama, and I can't wait to explore Samadhi Wellness a Thank little bit more. You. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, Amy. So I've had the opportunity to meet Sama, the founder of Samadhi Wellness. I've also had a class, checked out the cafe, but now it's time for me to see the treatments. And I've opted for a nice foot massage. Amy getting all the best gigs as usual, tapping into her wellness, all feeling very holistic, that's for sure. Uh, listen, don't forget, you can watch all of our exclusive interviews unedited on our YouTube page, plus all the behind the scenes from the studio as well. So make sure uh, you're subscribed now. Mm -hmm. Also, make sure to follow us on our Instagram page and use the hashtag DXB today to let us know what's happening in and around the best city in the world. Join us again tomorrow as we meet some of Dubai's sports personalities. In the meantime, here's a performance by our guest co-host, mental health advocate and recording artist, Ali Salama. I know you've been calling me, figuring it out don't make sense. You know I'll be home by three, wondering what you're feeling. My little fire is a mess. I'm not كنتي معايا في الحلوة والمرة ناوي going places فجأة لقيت قلبي مفتوح لك all I can't think about So we gon' stay We gon' We gon' Run away yeah. Like we used to now you say Menti fakra اليوم اللي عرفتك فيه And I told you honestly It's gon' be okay Cause we gon' run away, or run away طول الليل بدور في كل مكان كنتي معايا فيه وسبتي في ما بينا صور وصرت كتير افكر ازاي عدتي Let me sign you let me sign you, let me sign you, let me sign you. Let me sign you. May you can soul take on a hellas old sonati. So we gon' stay, we gon', we gon', run away, yeah. Like we used to now you say Menti fakra liom in life to fi And I told you honestly It's gonna be okay Cause we gon' run away or run away